showing you all of my stuffed animal collection that has grown rapidly. So, um, I took a little bit of a break last week. I hope you guys enjoyed the raining video. It just happened to rain, so I was like, might as well film. So, you're seeing a little sneak peek of my little collection. So, I'm excited to film this video because I got a few more cute stuffed animals since the last time. You've seen some of them in videos. You've already seen Clover if you've been on the channel before. This Highland Gale stuffed animal is so cute. I got it from Walmart during the Valentine's Day season. I love the little heart on his foot and I just think he's the cutest thing ever. And now we have some Squishmallows. This is Sunny the B1. I got this one at Five Below. Pretty much all of them came from Five Below except one I thrifted. Um, but yeah. And here's Calton. I thrifted him. He is so, so cute. And I love him. I love how soft Squishmallows are. And here is Bastion. Like Sebastian, but it's Bastion. And I got him, I think, last year or the year before. He is a Easter Squishmallow. And he's super cute. Super cute little bunny. And there's a little bunny tail. And then here's the OG. This is Connor. One of the original, I think, Squishmallows. Or one of the first ones that they did. And he's really cute. He's dirty. I've washed him, but I can't get the stains out. And here is Catalina. Uh, one of my cute little ones that I got from Walmart during the Valentine's Day season. And then we have Pinky, the giant flippables, Beanie Babies. She's huge and she's cute and you can make all kinds of sounds with her sequence. You've seen her in videos before because she makes some nice noises. And this is another cute Highland gal. This is Clara Bell. I got her from Walmart. She's super cute. I love her. I fixed her fur a little bit in this clip. And then we have a Care Bear from my childhood. It is super old. I just figured out what this one's name is. Lost a heart. But this Care Bear is from 2003. It is very old as you see on that tag. Next one is Tender Heart Bear. I really don't keep this one on my bed just because it looks so dirty even though I've washed it. This one's even older. It's from 2002. Now going back to newer stuffed animals. Here's this one that my mom got me because it looks like Chloe. Its name is Suzu. It is a Tybini baby. Next one is so special. If you look at it this close up, it looks like a my mom got me this one since my rabbit passed away because it's the same color, not the same kind of rabbit. This stuffed animal is like a lop rabbit. And my rabbit, Carmel, that passed away recently, um, she was a lion head. But this one has super soft fur. And the day that she gave it to me, I felt of its ears. And I used to rub her fur on her ears backwards. And this stuffed animal kind of feels like that, which is so crazy. But I really love this stuffed animal. And it's super special to me. It even has brown eyes like my bunny Carmel did. So that is crazy. Also, if you guys are wondering how my other rabbit's doing... She's doing fine. She's still eating. I'm keeping a close eye on her to make sure she's continuing to do well. So, yeah. But I was so surprised when my mom gave me this stuffed animal. Last stuffed animal is a stuffed animal I've really been wanting. And I've been selling stuff to make some money. So, I was like, I've had a hard time with my bunny passing away and I really don't feel like getting a real animal at this moment in time so I was like I'm gonna treat myself with a build-a-bear I haven't had one
one since I was a kid. So I made this beautiful long horn here and I named him Conrad. I love him. He's so cute. And I also got to bring another build a bear home for my little nephew. But I love Conrad and he just completes my cow collection. Not saying I won't get any more stuffed animals because you never know. But I love him and I'm so grateful that I got to go to build a bear and make him. He's a super cool stuffed animal. He sits up on my bed well. Some of my other stuffed animals fall down but he sits up really well and he's just super cute. So, that is my stuffed animal collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Here's a up-close look of all of my stuffed animals. By the way, I forgot to show you that little gnome, furry friends or whatever from Dollar Tree. But, that's a super affordable stuffed animal. I didn't show him up well, but I have him too. But, these are all of my beautiful stuffed animals. I love them. They're so cute. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm so sorry that it's so short. But just be expecting, I guess, videos. Videos kind of like this in the next couple of weeks where it doesn't really show my face, but I'm giving you some content because I've just really not felt like getting ready ready for a video i've been vlogging a little bit for my vlog channel and things of that nature but i'm just slowly getting back into the groove of filming and i know i need to film because when i film it makes me feel better it gets me in a better headspace so i need to be doing it more but sometimes setting up everything for a smart video is a lot of work and I haven't really had a lot of time to do that. So it, be expecting videos like this that are not so sit down and all of that. But just more voiceover kind of content. I hope you guys don't mind. But that is what I'm able to do right now. I'm also planning on just reposting some older videos on my community tab. So you guys can go back and watch those. So, again, here's a little overview of all of my collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully it was fun for you guys to watch to see all these cute stuffed animals. And continue to keep me in your prayers. I love you guys. And remember that Jesus loves you. But I'll see you guys, Lord willing, in another video soon. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.